What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. Oh, boy, man. You know, give some story time music, Demon. <clears throat> So the other day, I was chilling on the internet, not worrying about none of you niggas. When all of a sudden, I got a notification sound. Dima. And it was about my boy, Paul Pierce. The truth. Give him a round of applause. Now, shout out to Paul Pierce, man. I'm from Northern California. Uh, so I'm from, you know, Cali. And Paul Pierce, you know, uh, when I was in high school, he was you know, in college, stuff like that. And I like Paul Pierce's game, man. He was a really good player. Uh, he played the game really good. You know, he did it his way with the Kansas and all the shit, right? And Paul Pierce is now retired. Again, he's 43. That's important to understand, guys. 43. Stupid. And he's on ESPN and he gives, you know, some interesting commentary on, on ESPN Sports. Like, you think that Stephen A. Smith is opinionated. Paul Pierce is hella opinionated also, okay? Um, you know, he even says he's the, <laughs> he said like he's one of the best shooters of all the time. I mean, he says a whole bunch of crazy stuff that can't really be, you know, backed up, but he's entertaining, right? But then there's this situation that Paul Pierce had the other day. We can't show you all of it or hardly any of it because you know Dima's retarded. <laughs> And he might mess around and show the whole thing if the video flagged. But Paul Pierce is out here kicking it, man, with the thoughts high. Okay? He got the strippers in the background. They twerking, you know. And he got the, you know, the booty just bouncing everywhere in the background. And he in there with some of the niggas and stuff like that. Got his face all in the video. And, you know, I, I you know, like superstars, right? I guess... Some of the guys, <laughs> and he was getting roasted by the whole NBA, man. But I guess they have this thing on NBA where you can do like closed caption or closed friends or closed off. So I guess he was trying to basically share this with his homeboys. Well, what happened was <laughs> everybody in their mama saw it. Oh my God. Okay. Now I don't make, here's the situation. Paul Pierce is also married like a mug too. Okay. He has a wife. And all of this booty jiggling in the background, I mean, I'm not going to be mad, but it's too much. And the thing about it is, Paul Pierce, man, I can understand if you were 23. Nigga, you are 43. You're an old nigga like me. Like, come on, bro. I'm 39. I ain't even got the kind of money that you got, and I'm not doing that shit. Okay? It just goes to show you how some of our brothers, man, like, look, bro, you got a lot to lose. It ain't even the chicks exposing you. Nigga, you exposing your goddamn self. You stupid. You know what I'm saying? And as black men, come on, man. Paul Pierce, you been, look, bro, look. You are an NBA legend, 10-time NBA All-Star. You work for Disney, one of the most liberal outlets because ESPN is owned by Disney. You're going to get all this stuff, man. You know, you're taking advantage of women. You're doing all this other stuff. Look, bro. Why do you need to be able to show even the dudes that you try to do a close off with? All right. Some of them can screen record it and leak it to the press. You would never know who did it. Fam, man. Why do y'all got to keep doing shit like this? Bro, look, man. You got the strippers. You got the little broads. Okay. Which is even crazy to be doing right now with the Me Too stuff. You see your boy, uh, T.I., you know? You see your boy, the, 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 uh, Deshaun over on the Texas. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, chill. With your old ass, man. Deshaun Watson. Bro, you should be chilling. You know? You you still got a lot to lose. Okay, we know that y'all niggas be smoking weed. We know that you got bras, bro. I understand that, man. But you got to chill with some of that. And I'm going to tell what you some of you brothers out there, man. Some of you brothers don't want to listen to the OG. I've been trying to tell you. Especially you guys, 43. You know, your testosterone, man. I mean, I, I, it should be a little lower when you was 20 something. Don't be making young nigga mistakes, man. I know you're gonna still make mistakes, but come on, man. Going live with the hoes? Come on, my nigga. 
Now you might get fired. You're going to probably lose your wife. And then let's talk about... <clears throat> Damn it, give me some divorce court music, man. Like, you know, let's talk about this, man. Let's talk about the divorce court music. Because now, man... Okay. <clears throat> oh... Let's talk about the divorce court, divorce court situation. Why well, won't talk about that, nigga? You married, okay? You are a married man. Now they say you still married. I don't know how much longer you go be married, cause you and your wife got three kids, two daughters and a son. If she sees this, with all the booty clapping going on in the background, bro, you're getting divorced, okay? Your wife got three kids by you two daughters. You getting divorced, man, and your wife, your wife is going to take everything from you, man. I might have to call the lead attorney, man. I might have to call the lead attorney on this one. I might have to call you. I might have to hit him up. Because you're stupid, man. All she got to do is let me like, look, you see these hoes in the background. I done gave him three kids and... All of this, he twerking, smoking weed, cheating on me with younger strippers. And if your if your divorce is, is is in Cali, it's over, bro. Guys gotta start thinking, man. Look, no cameras, okay? No recording. You know what I'm saying? If you're gonna be with strippers, you need to put on a mask on or something. For real, I would do that. I would put on like a coronavirus, a Zorro mask. Be like, man, that do look like me, but that don't mean it is me. It's just showing the whole world, brother. It's just showing the whole world, brother. And I come on, come on, family. And I want to tell you young guys out there, man, just because you can do something don't mean that you're supposed to do something. Stop trying to show off for these niggas, man. I'm going to be real with you, bro. Stop trying to floss for these niggas because that's the only reason why he got caught up. Trying to floss for these niggas. You know what I'm saying? And then what happened? Just like me on YouTube, man. I got a few a few dollars. You know, I got a few food stamps in my pocket that play up. But I'm not about to come out here and try to front for y'all. I don't even like you niggas that much. You understand? Y'all here sandaling it all the way up, Paul. So, brothers, man, stop all of that with the thotting it up, man. Y'all niggas got to go somewhere with that. For real, family. But anyways, what do y'all think about this? Does Paul Pierce deserve to get his ass whooped? Oh, nigga flakes. <laughs> so, guys, what do you think? Subscribe, hit the bell, check out the first comment pinned to the top. Check out the Black Men Are Perfect t shirts. I really appreciate you, brothers, for all that you do. Subscribe, hit the bell, check out the first comment pinned to the top. As you know, the buffoon remains at an all time high. I am out. Peace!